you know, you could see it early. We just couldn't get going. And I thought our defense tonight was, was terrific. Uh, it kept us in the first half. And then the second half, I thought it won it for us. Is that when you don't have a practice? Is that wise so you can, your legs and stuff? Exactly. Yeah. And, 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 you know, we're going to be tired regardless. So my thinking is just whatever we have, we, you know, if it's one of those games, you, you at least you have something in the second half. And I thought it, it really paid off tonight. Um, I thought Ty did a great job before the game, you know, really talking about our team defense and, and where we've had some slippage. And I thought, uh, you know, we got more dig outs tonight than we've done in four or five guys, games from the post because we just stopped doing it. You know, how many times we see David Lee drove all the way in the paint, no help, and lay it in tonight every time one of the bigs got in the paint, one of the guards got their hands on it. Uh, I thought that was terrific. Doc, how difficult is it to play defense when you've played so many games? It's hard, yeah, it is. What is it, 10 games in 15 days or whatever? Uh, that's just, it's just hard, and uh, we have two more. So uh, uh, just tell them, you know, we're not doing anything tomorrow. We'll have a light shoot around in Denver, uh, and we just got to get through it. And, and I'm proud of our guys. You know, overall, we've, been, we've, we've held together pretty good in this. Is it more middle? Physical, is it both? No, I think it's physical. Usually I always say that. I always lean on that side. But this one I'm going to have to say, I think this is literally physical. You can, you can visually see it uh, at times today. And uh, so we just got to get through it. You know, I, I, I don't know about everybody, but I know a lot of teams, somebody else is going through this at some point in the season. And, you know, this is actually when you increase your lead or, or catch someone because you went through it and you did well. And another team may go through it and they don't do well. And that puts you in a different playoff spot. So, you know, this, this is an important stretch for us. How about the way Jordan maintained his physicality and his aggressiveness despite the fouls? Yeah, that was great. And that's a great pickup because that's, a, that's an area of growth, in my opinion. Uh, him and Blake, you know, we noticed early in the year, if they got early fouls, then they were more concerned about not fouling, which creates more trouble. And I thought today, you know, I think it was about four minutes, five minutes left in the game, someone drove and DJ jumps up blocks the basket, and no foul because he got his hands up. You know, that wouldn't have happened a month ago. That would have been a dunk by that guy. And uh, that's just terrific. And the depth you people have with uh, Terrible. you guys getting uh, you know, two fouls each in the first four minutes, four and a half minutes. Yeah. It's nice when you have Jamal to bring in. Uh, you know, you have Matt to bring in. You have Turk. Uh, Turk, by the way, has been he's been fantastic. His passing is... I mean, uh, I knew he could pass. I mean, I, I tells you how I guess bad I am. I've played him in two playoff series, but I didn't see this. I didn't notice this. Maybe that's why they kept scoring, you know. But he can really pass the basketball, and, and as you can see, we're running a lot of stuff with him being the ball handler for us, and that's been great for us.